the Bible say in the second Corinthians 5 17 if any man be in Christ if any man be in Christ he's a new creature old things are passed away all things become new so my two-part series what to make you a Christian and what make you not a Christian let's talk about what makes you a Christian what makes you a Christian he go to God is five days and the other one he go to God as we go by we'll tell you the other he go to God ain't that does not make you a Christian what say five B's that make you a Christian number one you gotta believe the Bible say without faith we pass the to please God they that come unto God but first believe that he's a rewarder of them that diligently seek him that's the first B number two you will be baptized hallelujah because in Acts 2 38 say repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of your sins and you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost for the promise unto, you, unto them they go to God the third B is you to be born again born again he go to God come with change born again don't mean you are the, you are the same he go to God so he go to God you believe baptized hallelujah born again he go to God and the other B is bow who are you bowing to he go to God like Shakrat, Meshach, and Abednego. They say, King, we're not careful to answer you. Our God will deliver you out of your, your hand and from the fiery furnace. And the Bible said they put them in the fiery furnace. And the king opened the door. And they say the fourth one looked like the Son of God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And the, and the last one is the Bible. We got to study the Bible. Hey, how can you how can you be saved if you don't read the Bible? How can you save if you don't live by the Bible? How can you be saved, my friend, if you don't study to show thyself approved unto God and work when the need to say rightly, dividing the word of truth? Amen. So what makes you a Christian? Hallelujah. Glory to God. What makes you a Christian? You got to believe. Believe who? Jesus Christ. Baptized. Baptized of the water and baptized by the Spirit. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. Three, you'll be born again. Born from above. Not going back in your mother's womb. You're too big. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And bow. Who are you bowing to? Hey, glory to God. Amen. And then, hallelujah. The last one. Is the hey, a little glory to God. Are you reading the Bible? Hallelujah. How can you be sharp when you read all these different books and are reading the Bible? Now, second part is what make you not a Christian? Hey, glory to God. If you don't acknowledge that Jesus is a son of God, you are not a Christian. Hey, glory to God. And then the second A, I'm talking about the five A's that you are not a Christian. The first one, acknowledge. You don't acknowledge Jesus. And, it's, and, it's, and the second A is answer. Who, who give you answer? Oh, glory to God. Who gave you answer? Hallelujah. Everybody, Jesus Christ is the answer. If you go to Buddha, if you go to Hindu, if you go to Shinto, if you go to all these people and don't go to Jesus for answer, my friend, I come and tell you, 
Hallelujah, you are not a Christian. Hallelujah. Ah, uh, and number, number third, number third is your parents. Hallelujah, your parents, my friend. How can you call a call yourself a Christian and dressing like that? How you can be, can be a Christian and showing your breasts? How you can be a Christian and going to God and showing your body parts, your cliches, your parents? The Bible says, dress as becoming saints. I know the Bible says, don't don't render your your garment, render your heart. But my God, Hallelujah, Amen. And we we don't know we don't know, my friend. If you don't know Jesus Christ is Alpha and Omega, you are not saved. Because Jesus Christ is the beginning and he's the ending. So I say, hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. You got to acknowledge Jesus. Jesus Christ got the answer. Hallelujah. And it's your parents. And your, yeah, your parents, your parents, my friend, how you dress. You are just as becoming saints. We think by us wearing makeup and by us wearing tight clothes and you don't get a man. You don't get a man by that. No man want a woman that shows off her body parts. Your body part is for your husband. Your body part is for your wife. Hallelujah, glory to God. And, uh, and, and uh, the other, a uh, hey, glory to God, is known that Jesus Christ is the Alpha and Omega. Hey, glory to God. He's the beginning and he's the ending. It's amazing that people think that Jesus Hallelujah, is a fallen angel. They think Jesus Christ is the Antichrist. Hey, glory to God. I'm gonna tell you, my friend, how do you be surprised how many people don't recognize that Jesus is the Christ? Hey, glory to God, hallelujah. And another one, we gotta, oh, glory to God. We are let Jesus, let, we are let Jesus allow the word of God to change us. What we gotta do, we gotta allow, A, allow the word of God to change us. If we don't allow the word of God to change us, my friend, you are not a Christian. Hey, glory to God. And the last one, my friend, is application. Hey, glory to the application mean applying. We gotta apply the word to our life. You ain't apply the word to your life, my friend. Hey, glory to God. You, you don't allow the word of God in your life and you apply the word to your life. How can you be a Christian, my friend, if you're not doing these A's in your life? You gotta acknowledge him as Lord and Christ. Hey, glory to God. Well, I say, you gotta acknowledge him as Lord and Christ, my friend. Hey, glory to Jesus Christ got the answer. Hallelujah, he's the answer to your question. And if you're going to everybody else for answer, you, hey, you are going to the psychic hotline for answer. Hey, you are going all the time to the doctor. I ain't saying nothing wrong with the doctors now. Hallelujah. Hey, you are, glory to God. You are. Not, you don't have the appearance. Look how you dress. Hallelujah. You witness somebody, they're looking at your legs. You witness somebody, my friend, they're looking at your chest. Hey, cover up. Hey, glory to God. So I'm telling people, my friend, what makes you a Christian and what does not make you a Christian? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The B and A's, my friend. The B and A's that make you, hallelujah, a Christian. What does not make you a Christian? And be a Christian, my friend. You got you to gotta work to be a Christian. After you get, receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, then you start working your salvation with fear and trembling. So what makes you a Christian and what does not make you a Christian? My friend, hallelujah. Being a, being a Christian is the best thing that ever happened in my life. Hey, glory to God, because I have access. Hallelujah, that's not, not another A. I have access to heaven. I have access to God to answer my prayer. Hey, glory to God. So those are the, the A's, hey, glory to God, that Glory to God, say you are not a Christian, but if you have access, you are a Christian. What do you think people pray don't is not answering? The Bible says, God don't hear sinner, but if any man doeth his will, hallelujah, and worship him, him he heareth. So my friend, God, hallelujah, can save you. Hallelujah, what's it? God can save you, but you, you gotta be 
willing to want to be saved because God not going to force you to be saved. Glory to God. Thank you for watching and thank you. Glory to God for tuning in to Life Journey. Glory to God International. I'm so glad you're part of this ministry. And don't forget to leave a comment. Hey, go to God, subscribe to my, my, my channel. And put a notification that I do a video almost every day. Try to inform you, a Christian, to make it to the pearly gate one day. God bless, peace.